Hi, everybody. We're going to talk about research using school and educational records today. And I thank you for joining us, and I hope you'll have a good time. My name is Beth, and uh, here we go. The educational backgrounds of our ancestors often provide valuable clues for genealogical research. Schools of all varieties play a pivotal role in the socialization process of individuals. This is especially true at the elementary, middle, and senior high school levels. In previous gene generations, lifelong friendships and relationships often grew out of these early years. Class rosters, school, school photographs, and yearbooks can provide many interesting personal insights. Items of this nature are generated by schools at all academic levels, including trade and vocational schools. Record, records created by and about educational institutions often provide significant insights into the world our ancestors lived in and reveal how those factors would later define their personalities and soci society in general. Some of the most com common sources where references to individuals may be found are listed. Uh, you might use school histories, clan lists, report cards, student profiles, dis, uh, discipline reports, awards for academic or athletic achievements, also photographs and diplomas. Educational records are often found in the archives of original school districts or institutions that created them. Items such as report cards, award for achievement, Photographs and diplomas may be in the possession of an ancestor, child, or distant relative. Many of these items may have survived in some old filed cabinet or desk drawer at home. Keep this in mind when planning a visit to the home of a relative or family member whom you su suspect may have this type of information and not realize the significance of the material. Records for schools that closed over the decades have survived in a variety of locations, such as local libraries, local genealogical societies, local historical societies, county administrative offices of the current school boards, museums, state, local, private, private and federal archives. My goodness, lots of work when you do genealogy. Thank you so much. We'll be back again. Bye now.